Okay, what's up guys? This town got he the Nogo here and I am going to record Outlast today. And let's see if this uh playthrough could outlast my other playthroughs. Ha ha ha. Nicola, your intros are season. terrible. Shut up. And to help me uh through my trek uh through the what is it called? Mount Massive Asylum? Is Braxton? So I've tried recording earlier, but my damn computer had to restart on me. Oh, yes, I did it. So let's do this. <laughs> you are Miles Upshur, an investigative reporter whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of hell on earth, always willing to risk digging into the stories no other journalist would dare investigate. You will seek out the dark secret at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can. Record everything. You are not a fighter to, um, to navigate the horrors of Mount Massive and expose the truth. Your only choice are to run, hide, or die. Nicola, you're gonna die a lot. Just saying. Yep, absolutely. Like, no, I'm, not, I'm not even. I'm not even insulting you. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably gonna. There's uh, there's plenty some of, of them are gonna be just because I'm, I'm an idiot. You later. That's primarily all of them. Don't you say? Oh! I got Kate killed. I'm Yo, such a why great would you get, Why would you kill Kate? She got herself killed, to be honest. You can still revive her, right? Yeah. Or are you playing on survival? Uh. Oh, dude. I'm not playing on survival. To skip this, or do I have to just do it? You have to do it again. It's a repetitive thing, I know. Trust me. Why does I mean, everything have you play this game? Uh, I've been trying to beat it on insane mode, to be honest, and I think I finally figured out the definition of insanity. Okay, you don't know me. I have to make this quick. They might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consult at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems uh, Facilities in Mount Massive. All s sorts of NDAs I am very much breaking right now, but seriously, F those guys. Terrible things happening. There, don't understand them. Understand it. Don't believe half the things I saw. Doctors talking about dream therapy going too deep, finding something that had been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt and Murkoff is making money. It needs to be exposed. <laughs> exposed. Alright. Oh hey, look at this camera. Do you think anybody knows? Anybody seen a camera as old as this? Ah. Like, what time period does this take place in? 2012 or so. Maybe 13. It takes place in whatever year it was published. And he's not using an iPhone? He's probably from an earlier time. Okay, since I've already done this, I know... Oh! What? Was it to look back? Oh, alright. Hey, Nicola, when you get to the, uh... After Chris Paul Walker throws you off the cliff, um... Is or not off the cliff, off the thingy. Is that Nosa Sky? Uh, that's... Bat guy. Yeah! 
Anyway, once you get to that part, before you go down to the generator room, walk up to the elevator and hold the X button. Turn it I on. I know, I've seen that. I will be back. Alright. Oh! I gotta entertain you guys for a couple of seconds. Oh. Oh, hey, look at this. Um, it's so... Oh, look at this. It's dark and... It's all messed up. Alright. Is there anything in here? What, is, what sound is that? Oh no, blood! Let's see if there's anything here. Oh hey, a battery! Thank god. and read it. Oh no, there's blood. Better go up the way that... where the blood leads to. What does that say? There's a person there. Oh no! <laughs> if you look closely, even though I knew it was coming, I still jumped a little bit. I am back. They killed us. They caught out. The variants. It's what they call the guys variants. I have no clue what a variant is in that game still. <sighs> Little fake. Hey, hey. Oh, come on. Okay, what he threw me. What are you playing on? Normal, where, what else would I be playing on? I don't blame you for your first place. Your normal's pretty hard. And who are you? Uh, Miles Morales? Wait, no, that's a different Miles. I... I see. Oh, Merciful God, you stupid have sent being me bad the is not Guard your life, son. What I wanted you to. have a calling. Okay, um, Father, <coughs> you're creeping me out a little bit. Okay, uh, I woke up, Braxton. Braxton? Huh? Okay, let let me just do the thing where you told me to do. Uh oh, you hit that part. Oh no, he fell. So sad. Who is that I, guy? Uh, I can tell your fans, um, enjoy your enthusiasm towards the game. So I'm supposed to record that? Record what? Damn it! I didn't mean to, like, witness. Oh yeah, if you... That's a note. You probably already missed a few notes, Nick. Like, in the beginning they're hidden pretty well. So for the notes I'm supposed to just record them? I would keep your camera up the entire game and never put it down. Really? Yeah, it doesn't take battery to have it up. So where do I go now? Um... What part are you at? That part? Uh, go to the computer lab.
So where's the computer lab? Go back to where you got thrown and then go directly to your left. Okay. Proclaim the gospel. Yeah, you might want to do that too. Wait, do what? I was joking. Ah, oh, Nicola. Why? <laughs> oh. Is is the computer room with the guts? Yeah, it should have like a ton of dead bodies. And the door closes. Uh, it didn't close when I went in, but yeah. Or am I in a different area? So you go exactly where you get thrown. You go across into a computer lab. At the far end of the computer lab, there should be a uh, entrance you can go into. Once you go into that entrance, you'll find the Chris Paul Walker uh, no. case file. All right, let me just pick up this note. Uh, let me take a selfie. The four, the four fatalities contain enough ambiguous data to make any litigation, if evidence is correctly managed, impossible. Project Wall Rider remains a dangerous initiative, and that will, and there will almost certainly be further casualties. As with the others, however, family and government interest in the patients is so low to make any chance of legal actions vanishably unlikely. Violence among patients is increasing as the morphogenic u engine uh, therapy gets closer to producing working models, but a combination of physical and chemical restraints has proven significantly effective to assure continued uh, control and profit. <laughs> Why should we have to pay for it? Why do we have to die? Walker will kill us just for being sick. We're some people. We didn't choose this. Walker will kill us Walker just for being us. sick? He's a he's a troubled man. I guess Afghanistan will do that to you. Oh. Wait, so how do I enter in? No, that's that's closed. Oh. That was entirely open. So where is it, Braxton? Uh did you pick up the Chris Walker case file? No, uh, where is it? So, did you did you go into the room in between the computer lab and the next area? It's like a small room with a bunch of shelving. Uh, yeah. Okay, go to the right. Oh, I see it. Yeah. All right. Project Wall Rider. Uh, Mount, uh, Massive Co. Case number 136. Uh, pa patient initials CL Walker. Uh, fix your mic. Uh, fix your mic. What's it doing? Uh, static. Static. Oh, Therapy sorry, status. I had it pressed up. Alright, morpho morphogenic, uh, engine activity practicate, uh, at roughly 2,000 ppm. Unsafe to progress beyond stage 3 hormone schedule. Diagnostic. Biometry revealed light to medium bronchial accumulation. MRI scans consistent with patient's reported dreams. Interview. Walker was in interviewed in restraints following his self-inflicted mutilations. Restraints have had to be altered to accommodate his enormous extensive dermal e eruptions as consistent with failed Morphogenic uh, engine oh, cellular God, activity. So he claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows for a truer way of seeing. Seems to have some boyhood experience with. Uh, oh, Tuatara lizards and their parental eyes. He has expressed he has expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose. Attending orderlies 
should be advised to watch for further self-mutilation. The mental traumas be he sustained while serving in Afghanistan seems to be retarding uh, progress progression of the ME process. His predominant fixation, predominant amplified fixation. by therapy, is a manic exaggeration of military security protocol. A continuation of both chemical and physical restraints is highly recommended. Well, you didn't restrain him enough. You actually have sympathy for that guy? You haven't played on insane mode. He is no, the like, only guy I've died by, Nicola. Is that a live guy? In a wheelchair? What am I supposed to do about this guy? Just walk past him. He's not gonna do anything. He's, you know, in a wheelchair. Up, oh, there's two guys watching TV. What should I do about them? If you're gonna try and figure out what to do about everything you walk by, you're gonna be doing a lot of math, Nicola. Should I just run it? I, I mean... Yes. Yeah. Is there any point for them? Or... You record them and you get a note. Yeah, any... Do I have to go anywhere else? Uh, just leave that room on the other side. Wait, other side? Uh, in that same room, if you go behind the couch, there's a crouching area. They're not even watching, they're just looking at blood splatter TV. Wait, are they it's gonna like notice It's like boarded me? and you gotta crawl under. Are they gonna notice me? Who? The guys watching the TV. Read the note. Wait, how do I read it? You press uh, left on the D-pad. Oh, I've already beat all to help. Uh, picking broken glass out of my scalp, complete compile cracked ribs. Nearly killed by a deformed giant. Looks like somebody tried to his face with the, his head with a cheese grater. He throws me through a wall, knocks me unconscious. I wake up and somebody some doughy old man with a face like an alcoholic kitty fondler in a homemade priest outfit calls me his apostle. Not a job I asked for. I never asked for this. There are words scrawled in blood everywhere. I'm getting an uh, ugly feeling in my gut that the priest is writing them and for my benefit. Oh god, I should probably start a new video.